Hey everybody! I like to start the year on this channel with a little casual talking video and my topic for today is 5 hurdy gurdy players you should have listened to if you're just starting out with the instrument or if you just want to know more about the hurdy gurdy. I want to put a little disclaimer first. This is only my opinion. This is not a ranking and I probably will forget somebody that I really like. Please write in the comments who are your favorite hurdy-gurdy players and why. So we can get into a little exchange and hopefully find new players and new music that we all like. Let's start! Number one! We go on a little journey to Spain and the first hurdy-gurdy player that I like to mention is Herman Diaz. He's an excellent hurdy-gurdy player and I did a course with him I think two years ago already and we did some awesome stuffs and techniques and he showed us his little tricks on cotton and rosin and it was really fun and he is playing like wonderful traditional music but also his own songs and compositions and he's all about beautiful melodies and tones and um, yeah some virtuosity <laughs> and some crazy stuff is going on there so you should definitely listen to him and Diaz. Number two. We stay in Spain and the player that I'd like to suggest to you is of course Efren Lopez. Efren plays a lot of Turkish and Greek folk music. I also did a course with Efren and he did some crazy stuff and showed us stuff we aren't really used to here at least in Germany. <laughs> in terms of rhythm and tuning and scales and this was really really fun and super interesting. Number three is a woman and I really adore her because she only plays early music on the hurdy-gurdy and she plays excellent and this is Toby Miller. I really appreciate her work and you should definitely listen to her music if you are into early music. Number four is Grégory Jolivet. He is a French player and he plays literally everything on the hurdy gurdy. He has an awesome technique and I really like his sound. Maybe you know him from the group Blausabella. He used to play there for a long, long time, but I think now he doesn't anymore, which is a pity. And last but not least, number five is Matthias Leutner. He plays a lot of um, contemporary music and modern compositions on the hurdy-gurdy and he is really like getting the instrument to go to its boundaries and like getting the most out of it using fancy techniques. He seems to be searching for new tones that the hurdy-gurdy can produce and it's super interesting to watch and to listen to. Of course all these hurdy-gurdy players are the big ones and you probably know them. What I like about all of these five hurdy gurdy players that I mentioned is that every one of them develop their own sound. So you can just recognize them only by hearing their playing. And I think that's something every musician would like to have. If you like this kind of video, I could make another list of five hurdy gurdy players. Please give me a thumbs up, share it in your social media, subscribe to my channel and follow me on Instagram and on Facebook. If you like to support my work and my music, I would be glad if you join my little Patreon community. All the links and the names of the five players are again in the box. I wish you all a very good start into this new year and I see you soon with some more music.